Okay, so back again. Uh, where were we? Yeah, so while I was out, um, all this lot from CEX was all got with uh, vouchers. But I decided I was up around the charity shops while I was there anyway. But I was on the, I'm, I'm on a bit of a tight budget at the moment with um, buying stuff with cash. Uh, so I steered away from DVDs for a change. Um, and to be fair, there wasn't anything that stood out. Had there been something you know special, I might have picked it up. I did see a, a box set of uh, Father Ted, sealed box set of Father Ted. Um, the entire series, which was a fiver, which wasn't a bad deal, um, but even though it was sealed, the box was in shocking condition. Um, it's, it wasn't a box set with 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 uh, you know Amray um, cases inside. It was like a digi pack, and it was really badly crushed. So I decided to leave that. Um, same charity shop actually. Um, is it the Dogs Trust? Uh, I'm not sure. Anyway, in the window, which I almost completely missed, um, as I was walking by, they had some Blu-rays. And they only had a couple on the table in the window. Um, I'm not a couple, they had three or four. And I thought, ooh, but there's no price on them. So I went into the shop. I know that they keep all the DVDs away at the back. So I went to the back. Couldn't see any more Blu-rays. Um, so I thought I'd have a quick look on the table from the inside um, rather than from the window uh, and that's when I noticed actually in the window right at the bottom leaning up against the bottom of the window frame uh, there was a whole bunch of other Blu-rays so I sculled outside quickly now it was so easy to miss because the window of this shop is maybe six inches from the the pavement you know it's really really high window but very low window and they had they had the blu-rays on literally the floor of the shop leaned forward against the window but like the window frame was sort of up to here so you only you could only see that much of it but because it was leaned forward like that onto the window Walking past and looking down, you could barely see them. Anyway, I had a look. Um, and there was actually a little, little, tiny little sticker on the window. On the inside of the window. It probably wasn't a sticker, it was a piece of card with some blue tack. Um, it just said, uh, Blu-rays, £1 each. And as I was looking through, uh, the majority... Um, there was, was quite a few that I had. There was a few that I wasn't really that interested in, but there was three that I definitely wanted. So I said to, I went and walked in and said to the woman, you know, there's some, some of the Blu-rays in the window I'd like. Um, they were in such a way that uh, you couldn't just reach in and grab them from the inside. There was other displays in the way. So I had to go outside and point to the ones that I wanted. Uh, went to the checkout, given me three pounds, put them in my bag. And as I was leaving, uh, the door in this shop is right in the centre. So there's a big window either side. I noticed on the other side, <laughs> there was more Blu-rays that, I'd, again, I'd completely missed. And uh, I didn't, having looked, there was a couple more that I wanted. Um, so I went back and said, <laughs> uh, there's two more there. So I should grab the other two for me. So in total, for a pound each... Uh, I managed to get good fellas apocalypse now the aviator the day the earth stood still and finally reservoir dogs um, yep yeah, so I was really chuffed about that um, in hindsight, there was maybe a couple more that I could have got, but I didn't. Um, am I kicking myself? No, not really. There was, there was, there, had I been 
any others that I was desperate to get, I probably would have got them. Um, but yeah, I was happy with 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 those. Um, but that was it. That's everything else that I've uh, picked up from CEX, Poundland, and a charity shop. Although I did visit quite a few charity shops, I was a bit disappointed with their uh, Budwick Hospice because. Um, the Budwick Hospice in Darlington, like many others that I've, well not many others, but a couple of others I go to regularly, uh, usually have VHS tapes, um, and all I had was uh, about half a dozen kids' movies and nothing else on VHS, so I was a little bit disappointed with that. Yep, so I'll wrap this up now, because um, I think we're getting close to about 20 minutes, which I didn't want this video to be that long. Um, so, thanks very much for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Ta-da.